welcome back to my channel. Thank you for watching. Today I have a scrapbooking project share and my friend Ara actually has a Facebook group called Don't Hoard It and Use It. And so the whole premise behind this album is to use things that I have been holding on to for a very long time for the simple fact that they're pretty. So for starters, I need to peel the front of this sticker off. I have not done it because it is a pain in the butt and I don't embellish the front of my albums um, simply for storage reasons. I used a We Are Memory Keepers um, album. And so I am documenting today my bridal shower from 2013 and I used a DCWV paper pad. And so I embellished this very simply. I used a lot of the Mambi chipboard stickers and then just a few things that are my stash. Um, almost every photo has a doily and whatnot. But anyways, so let's get into it. This is the like front little page and I just put bridal shower 2013. This is a photo of me um, the day of my bridal shower. And so, I, like I said, I kept things very simple. I didn't pull from a specific collection. I didn't run off, grab a Maggie Holmes collection. Um, I've been waiting to actually scrapbook these photos for a very long time because the quality of them is very poor. They're very dark. So I, I've been very hesitant to scrapbook them. But you'll notice a trend that I use a doily and crepe paper and a glassine bag on all of the photos. The glassine bag is to hold these cards where each one of the guests actually on the back wrote some advice for marriage. So like I said, these are embellished, very, very minimal, very simple, but it's a good way to start busting my stash and using what I have. This is um, a like small pocket page from the open book overlays and my friend Deb actually sent these to me and this album as well and I'm using them today. So here I just used a cut apart that says this is my day and it kind of was because it was my bridal shower. So like I mentioned they are all very simple. On this side I added a little paper clip with a charm. There's lots of crepe paper and Again, this is one of the um, elements from that overlay pack and they're two by two little pocket squares and so I just added some sequins and a pom-pom and a Maggie Holmes clip here. And I did add like bow paper clips and some clips to the top just for added interest. I know the glare is awful. <laughs> I did add a little cut apart where I will do some journaling. Again, this is from the open book, just a piece of acetate. It was an overlay and I added some vellum with a cut apart. And then I did embellish a little on the back just because you could see all the adhesive. You can still see some, but it is vellum. All of the stickers that you are seeing are the Mambi, and I love them because they're gorgeous and you get a ton for the price of them. And then here in the back, I have just a glassine bag. I'm not quite sure what to do with this yet, but I had 35 women come to my bridal shower and these are the only photos I got. And so the rest of the cards are here and some extra photos. But yeah, guys, that is my Don't Hoard It, Use It album. I'm happy with how it turned out. Um, I did, like I mentioned, I added some bows and things like that to the top just for some pretties to stick out. Go follow her Facebook page. It is Don't Hoard It, Use It, and it's by my friend Ara. I know it's really simple and easy and it to hoard things in your stash um, and wait for the perfect day to use them or to not ever use them. But really guys, using what you have makes you feel good. You get to make pretty things, um, you know. So just use what you, what you guys have. Anyways, I will catch you guys on the next video. I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.